What is trisomy 13 and 18? Understanding trisomy can be difficult for families. Information can be hard to find and it may be a very emotional time. This short video aims to explain the basics of trisomy, what it is and what it could mean for your baby. Trisomy means three chromosomes. Chromosomes are like building blocks and contain all genetic information for an individual. Humans usually have 22 numbered pairs of chromosomes plus a pair of sex chromosomes, 46 chromosomes in total. These chromosomes are inherited from their parents, 23 from each. In trisomy, one of the numbered pairs contains three chromosomes rather than two, so the baby inherits 47 chromosomes rather than the usual 46. Having extra genetic material can cause difficulties with how the baby develops. We don't yet know why the extra copy occurs. There is nothing that could be done to prevent it. Soft UK primarily supports families affected by trisomy 13 and trisomy 18. There are different types of trisomy. Full trisomy means 47 chromosomes in every cell in the body. Mosaic trisomy means some cells have 47 chromosomes, but others have the usual 46. Partial trisomy means the usual 46 chromosomes, plus an extra copy of part of the affected chromosome. This is much rarer. The symptoms of trisomy occur on a spectrum. It is not possible to know how your baby will be affected before they are born. Although children with trisomy share common characteristics, each child is unique. Trisomy 13 means three copies of the number 13 chromosome, and it's also called Patel syndrome. Trisomy 13 affects approximately 1 in 4,000 pregnancies in the UK. Around 80% of babies will be affected by full trisomy. Trisomy 18 means three copies of the number 18 chromosome, and is also called Edwards syndrome. Trisomy 18 affects approximately 1 in 1,500 pregnancies in the UK. Although the conditions are different, they have many similarities. Babies affected by full trisomy 13 or 18 will have significantly delayed development, learning disability and health difficulties likely to include heart conditions, apnea or epilepsy, feeding difficulties, visual or hearing difficulties, developmental variations in the limbs, hands or feet, cleft lip and or cleft palate. It is rare for babies with trisomy 13 or 18 to have all of these conditions. The full versions of trisomy 13 and trisomy 18 are considered life-limiting. This means the condition affects how long your baby is expected to live. There is an increased chance of losing your baby during pregnancy, at birth or during the neonatal period. The impact of mosaic or partial forms of the condition on your baby are much harder to predict. Some individuals are affected by many symptoms of trisomy, while others have only a few health or developmental issues. The most important thing for families experiencing a trisomy diagnosis is to have the information and support they need. For more information and to hear a whole range of family stories, visit soft.org.uk and search for Soft UK on YouTube.